Okay guys, so like I mentioned in my previous video, I'm going to be testing out DLSS in Unreal Engine 5 and MetaHumans. Now, like I said, DLSS really helps me out when it comes to dealing with multiple MetaHumans because MetaHumans is pretty expensive. So I have a MetaHuman here, uh, Vivian. If you guys have been around in the channel, let me go ahead and dock this. Uh, you know Vivian. We use her quite a bit. So what we're going to do is I have DLSS off right now. So this is in the viewport right here. So you can see we're getting about 70 frames per second. And what I'm going to do is just drop a bunch of Vivians in this empty pool area right here and to see how many we can get until our FPS really starts to drop. Okay, so let's see if this is going to load up. Now, just a reminder, I am recording using Shadow Play. All right, so just keep that in mind whenever you're watching this video. So I'm gonna drop Vivian right here. Let's start with one. And I am actually gonna force Vivian to have only one LOD, which is the highest LOD. All right, so we gotta compile some shaders here and we'll be right back. All right, so it's finished compiling shaders. As you can see, we're gonna at 56, 57 FPS. So what I'm gonna do is just duplicate her here. And I'm just gonna Pretty much drop a new one in there. I'm gonna move here a little bit so I can see a little bit better. Let's duplicate it from here. On the LOD sync, I gotta make sure that they're all zeroed out because we're testing it out for real, for real. The zero. And this one should already be zeroed out. Okay, so we are at 40 frames per second. It's not doing too bad. And this is with it off, okay? How many is that? Six. Let's do seven. Drop down to 30. And I'm going to select every single one of them. And if I crash, I'll get right back to it, okay? Because I honestly didn't do a test prior to this. Yeah. Okay. Looks like we were able to. All right. So that's dropping down to 20 frames per second. And I'm probably going to take it easy because I don't, I don't want to crash it. So I'm going to do one by one now. Okay. It looks like that one's actually struggling already. Hang on. So that's 14 meta humans right here in the scene. And I think we just crashed. Okay, so we have 14 and we crashed. So what I'm going to do is I'm getting about 22.7 FPS and I'm gonna go ahead and turn on DLSS to ultra performance and see what happens here. I see that of it. And as you can see, we got, what, five? Five FPS back now. The flickering, I'm not sure what's causing that, but we did have a crash, so that's 14 meta humans. And I'm gonna get closer. This is about, again, 43, 42 up close. I'm gonna back out. I'm getting about 25 meta humans. So with Ultra performance turned on. Let's see if I can add another one. Okay, so I was able to actually add another one. So that's good because it crashed whenever I added one without. So let's keep adding until we crash and then we'll know our limit then. So yeah, 21 frames per second now. So we got about three extra meta humans with ultra performance on. Now this is a kind of cool because if you have a slower rig, you can use DLSS whenever you're working in your editor, you know, and then render high quality. So it's kind of cool. Now we're at 17.56. All right, so that's pretty good, 17.6. All right, so let's, let's keep going, like I said, until we crash and get a blue screen here. See if we can do another row of seven. Now, obviously, this is, again, very extreme case here. But we're just testing it out. So you can kind of see, really, the benefits of having an RTX card and 
DLSS. So we're down to like 13 frames per second. So I'll, that's probably good. We did four rows of seven. And that's including the NVIDIA Shadow Player recording this video at 60 frames per second. So now so let's keep going. Why not? So let's do another row. It's starting to really slow down here. 12.6. Oh, and there is the crash. All right, so that went ahead and crashed. So we're going to go ahead and stop the video here. <laughs> so if you have any questions, let me know, and I'll see you all later.